Hey guys, okay, so I did a lot of running to grocery stores, getting everything I need for okra soup. And I also decided to do a goosey soup. And this is expensive, okay? It was expensive. So yesterday, I went to Walmart and I was able to get some of my uh, items. And I thought I only had two more items to get, but I ended up getting way more than two. And I'm gonna show you what I got so far. And I'm gonna tell you the stores I went to. All right, so yesterday when I went to Walmart, I got um, some garlic, a red onion. I got some shallots. I got um, habanero peppers as well as red bell pepper and i got uh i'm gonna just call them sereno peppers like chili peppers so that's gonna be on my pepper sauce and then smoked turkey i got the okra and then i got kale now this is gonna be for my okra soup all right so also i needed fish so i had to go get fresh fish from the market so i ended up getting some today and i'm gonna show you but before I got fish, I had went to an African market called, uh, what is it called? Also, it's a new African market. It's in Arlington, Texas. And I was able to get um, some of Goosey grounded. Um, so a Goosey is grounded uh, pumpkin seed. So I, it was already grounded. I got that. And then I got Mama's Choice Fufu Mix. Then I got some fresh plantain. I had to get palm oil. Palm oil is what you're going to need for your okra soup and your agusi soup. Um, and then that's the three items I got from there. And I think I spent $30 yesterday. That was like 30 something. Then I ended up getting this. So I just spent a lot today. So I ended up picking up some um, spinach because that's gonna go in the agusi soup. I was gonna do kale, but I heard kale is a little too strong for it. So I'm gonna do uh, spinach. I got some more red peppers. I got tomatoes. They go in the pepper uh, sauce. I got shrimp and then I got fresh catfish and i had to go to kroger's to get the catfish and i got the shrimp while i was there then i went back to walmart got this this these items so anyway stay tuned y'all all right so i'm about to get ready to put my smoked turkey meat inside of the dutch pot i'm going to be using this dutch pot because this is a really good pot um so i'm going to start doing the okra soup now and then i'm gonna use some of that meat for um the goosey soup so bear with me guys Smoked turkey's in there. Now I'm putting the shallots in here. I'm gonna put, um, boil it with my meat. I'm also gonna put red onion. So I'm gonna make my cutting time and cut it, okay? This is a uh, veggie chopper and it comes with 13 to 15 different blades. Um, we're gonna be using a lot of convenience here, okay? And this is also available on my TikTok shop as well as Amazon. Everything will be there, including the pots and pans. Anyhow, so I am cutting up the red onions. I'm going to be using this for um, my pepper sauce. I'm going to also uh, use this. Well, you'll see. So I'm going to put some in the turkey meat because I got smoked turkey meat. Right. Um, and I'm seasoning it with just basic salt. And I'm using cayenne pepper. I really don't like black pepper. Now I'm taking my catfish and I'm going to take it out of the package. And I have mine. It's de-scaled. I have no scales on it. But there is bone and stuff in the inside. So I'm going to go ahead and wash that. We want to make sure we always wash our meat. Then I'm going to cut them into quarters. Now I'm about to clean my okra. I have garlic. I'm putting it in. I have red bell pepper, habanero, onion, and chili pepper. That's for the pepper sauce. Now I'm going to take my broth and I'm going to put a little bit in, of it inside of the blender to make my pepper sauce. And I'm going to blend it up really well. This blender is also available on my TikTok shop. And once I get it to the consistency I want, now I'm going to put a little olive oil in a frying pan. And I'm going to uh, stir my catfish. Not cooking it all the way, but you get a little brown on both sides. Then I'm going to add that into my smoked turkey meat, the broth, because we, we're getting flavor here. So I'm going to get all the pieces in there. Next, I'm going to my okra. Now, this is a convenient way to cut your okra. And it's going to give you the shape, the shape that you want. I just gave y'all a hat. Go get your veggie choppers. Look at that. Look at that. And so this is the blade that I'm using to chop the okra. Now, I'm going to use my palm oil. Sorry, my palm oil. And I didn't know this stuff was thick. This is some thick oil. But... It's required. Now I'm putting in red onion. And this is going to be my stew. The base of it. 
and you're gonna cook it now it might look like that stove is a pie but look it's an electric stove it's the height i mean the temperature that i need now i'm adding in my pepper sauce i'm going to use better than boyan i'm not using that uh boyan cube none of that i'm using better than boyan and then i'm going to add um garlic uh powder seasoning the actually there was garlic powder and anyway so now I have my okra because I blended some okra up as well. So I'm going to have blended okra and then I'm going to have whole okra. And I'm going to mix everything together. Adding more seasonings. Now I'm adding in my, my meat. So I have shrimp, smoked turkey, and fish. I didn't want no uh, shaki or pomo. I don't, I don't like eating that. Um, and I didn't get any stock fish because I don't like a really fishy um, taste. Uh, when I'm eating my okra soup. So this is it for this video. Make sure you guys stay tuned for my uh, goosey and I have more videos to follow after. Be sure to follow me for more because I have more videos to come after this. And make sure you check out my TikTok shop. There are a lot of great items in there and currently right now there is a sale going on. I'm adding in broth that's going to give extra flavor to my okra soup. And look at that. There's a lot of greatness and flavor going on in this video. Another video coming down.